I hope so. Ah! Hello everyone, this is Charlotte, and today we're going to be playing Perfect Spawn, a game where you go out to a cemetery to have some alone time. Um, just to let you know, this is the second game I have played from this developer. I have played another game from them before. So I'm pretty interested to check this one out. So let's not waste any more time and get started. What is a perfect spot? It's a place where you make the best memories while the rest are silent. In that place. In my mind, I see that town. That's a reference to Silent Hill, too. Find a perfect spot. Okie dokie, then. Um, hey, can we just leave? We don't have to do this if we don't want to, right? Nope. You don't have a choice. Is the dumpster a perfect spot? Nope. Missing people? That's kind of concerning. But... Probably nothing we need to worry about. Hmm. Church. Huh. Missing person. More missing people. Well, this is a little concerning, isn't it? Probably nothing major, though. We're not careful. We might mind on that poster, though. That statue's not gonna come to life, is it? Eh, that's some Doctor Who type shenanigans right there. Alright, this looks significant. Get a shovel from the car. Okay. All right, gonna grab a shovel from the car. That'd be too hard. Nope. Grab the shovel. Dig up the spot. No. Grave robbing is a bit of a crime, but I guess that's not going to stop you, is it, huh? Nope, not at all. Alright, time to dig, dig, dig. And hopefully not get caught. Because if we do get caught, that would be bad. That would be really bad. Alright, looks like we're going to be digging for a while. Okay, we're done. Get body from the car. We're playing as a murderer, aren't we? Yep. We're a bad person. Oh, boy. Buddy, you got yourself in a lot of trouble. Oh, my God. What do we do to you? Oh, no. We're not gonna really do this, are we? Yeah, we are. Repent your sins in the church. You're the big man upstairs is gonna forgive you for this? I hope so. Ah! Crack! Okay, let's go inside. I, I don't like this anymore. You know, it's actually all starting to make sense. Those are probably people we, uh, made go bye-bye. Forever. Alright, let's go.
Nope, don't get the key for that. You know, that door kind of reminds me of the one from, what was it, Silent Hill 4? How many of you know about that game? Uh, hello. You look friendly. As in, not very, as in, very much dead. Oh boy. I'll take that. Thanks. Gotta open the door. Yep, gotta open the door. Oh crap. Well, that's one way to get ahead. Unintended. <laughs> oh, ooh. So, are these, like, supposed to represent our victims? It was more than just those three, wasn't it? Yep. I have a feeling I know what we're gonna use this for, and I don't like it. Which one's got the key? Ooh, ooh. I feel bad about what I just did. Ooh. You know, coming here wasn't such a great idea, was it? Nope, not at all. Yeah, this is looking like an increasingly bad idea. You know what? We're gonna get the bad ending first and just leave. Yep, just gonna go home. Be haunted by our sins forever. Alright, time to drive away. Alright, that's it. And I'll see you through editing on the next ending. Alright, I guess it's time to repent. Oh boy. This is gonna go well. Alright. Time to repent. Now this is looking less and less like a house of the Lord. Oh! We're going to prison. Makes sense. I mean, I mean technically... I guess we just turned ourselves in, huh? Yep. I'm assuming that's what happened. We turned ourselves in. Alrighty then. That's the end, everybody, and I hope you enjoyed it. See you on the next video. And today's comment of the day award goes to Unifers Software.